Faith Answers. I'm coming back to you to talk to you about jumps. We have gone through, this will be the fifth of our seven movements of dance. Our seven movements of dance are bend, stretch, rise, dart, and today we jump. You need all of the pieces that we've learned up until this one in order to do this one. So first you learn to bend, then you learn to stretch, then you learn to rise, which is a kind of stretching upward, and then you learn to dart. And what you notice when you see all of these pieces together is that all of the muscles that you're using to do those steps are leading you to the next one, and that's what jump is. It's really quite important. There are many, many, many ways to jump, but the way that I show you today is a plain tomp levé. Tomp levé is French for time in the air. Anytime you jump, you must bend your knees. So the first thing that we do in order to jump is we plie, bend. When we bend, we're going to push the ground away underneath us, I'm doing it in slow motion. And then we straighten our knees as hard as we can and we come up onto our tiny feet until we go all the way, all the way up and we can push off the ground for a second. So our legs are going from plie to elevé to dégagé. And then at the end, we stretch to hold. That's all four of the movements that we've had built into movement number five. I'm gonna suggest that you put your hands behind your back when you try this and try it many times. Not once, not twice, 20, 30 times. It takes years to get it right. I know it feels easy, but if it feels easy, you might be forgetting something. So to do this step, you bend your knees and jump. Bend your knees and jump. Bend your knees and jump. Make sure that when you jump, you lock your knees. Make sure that when you jump, you point your toes. And make sure that when you jump, you start and land in plie. There are lots and lots of different jumps but the simple tomp levé in first position is the one that we do the most so that we can get jumps right. Because if you can jump right this way, you can figure out how to jump right in another position, or what you'll see the most of is changement, which is the same jump, but we change our feet. In another video, I'll show you the five ballet positions. But next up, we're going to come to number six in our seven movements. And that will be turn.